Hi everyone. This is the update on the recently featureless Hoya Glabra Schlechter. If you can see something glossy and sheen, yeah, that's the new leaf I have. And if I touch it from the bottom, it has hardened up and uh, it's bigger than my palm and as much as my hand. So we were expecting leaves from the top. That's why I traversed all the bare vines of this wonky cane. That's what I could get at that time. But these vines will not perform the way we want always. Right. Once they get the stability, they might throw off leaves from the bottom too. And at the same time, one of the top vines had this very, you know, malnourished leaf. Uh, I do not know from where I cut it. Uh, I'll show it to maybe uh, along the way. But what I did was I took that one node cutting and inserted here. This is that leaf, right? Because there was the main mother leaf onto this side which has got uh, chlorosis uh, because of uh, magnesium deficiency which I kept and then it tore uh, by banging onto the pole so I just took it off that cleared a lot of real estate from either uh, like both of those uh, trellises and poles so I thought I'll just take that, uh, cut it from the top uh, and you know, insert it into the media and see what happens. Uh, that uh, did not trigger the leaf, right? I only inserted that cutting yesterday when I brought this up uh, just to do a... a video for you but I ended up not doing it because I lost a lot of light so now that I'm doing it I just wanted to tell you because at the initial uh, reporting sorry uh, retrolicing I did not uh, take off any of the vines I just kept you know traversing and leaving this part B2 <laughs> so I am badly in need of a permanent Tracing method, which I am also looking into now. It will be something from some sort of metal that does not heat up too much. I'll just do an example, uh, a sample, and uh, show you uh, whether I'm going ahead with that. But until then, it's the wonky cane trellises I'll be using. So I have bigger leaves than the current one, right? Uh, these are narrower but longer and this is even bigger I think this is the biggest leaf I have see you cannot see my hand so it's that big uh, but um, I had to remove that mother leaf that was the largest I am expecting a pinnacle from this let's see how this stability creates pinnacles or not create pinnacles because you know I have been thinking about not trellising my hoyas at all so I just have decided to leave them be or trellis them in, in a very you know uh, lighter way uh, without totally trying to make it very neat and tidy so there will be you know pinnacles popping up i know pinnacles pop up even from the you know smallest nodes but those pinnacles can be the pinnacles that came with your cutting the rooted cutting also sometimes uh, with the maturity of the stem or the wine the total wine only the pinnacles will pop up mainly 
because when it comes to the energy the stem would have or whatever the enhancers you may spray on them right so i know i have seen in a lot of videos that a lot of uh, pinnacles pop up you know even in smaller cuttings that is basically uh, because of you know uptakes uh, in nutrition so there are so many bloom boosters and stuff like that in the market now uh, people can use them and you know get a pinnacle to enhance blooming that's how it is that's how that's what the sellers use that's what the nurseries do we all know that especially when it comes to orchids so here i am not using anything other than negative which i am not spraying regularly even you guys know i'm so you know, bad on fertilizing now so now um we'll leave this like this and i just wanted to show you the update of hoya blah brush lecture and tell you all that vines will not throw off leaves from where we expect them to be they will do what they want and uh, you just have to accept that right so what we have to do is to give it stability or not give it stability and leave them be and see if either which way you go would promote them into throwing out pinnacles and bloom thank you guys for watching have a great day see you again in another video bye for now